Hello. All right, today I have a special four-part video coming to you guys. I will be act, uh, reacting to a singer um, whose name is So Huang. Um, I have been told that she is a cancer survivor and that she's been uh, helping like the community and doing charity and all that. And I am in love with with um, her kindness. Um, and I also did additional research and I saw that she's like the Korean Mariah Carey and all this good stuff. So I am really, really happy to be reacting to this person. Um, so yeah, I will be starting off with um, her performing I Have Nothing. The original singer is Whitney Houston. So that's already like eye catching because like not everybody should be covering Whitney Houston. So yeah, so I'm excited to see how she does. So let's get right into it. She's pretty. I like her her facial expression. I support, I support. Yes. That sounded nice. This sounds really, really nice. I feel like everybody in the audience is like, like either they don't know the song or they're just like bored out of their lives or something. But like, I'm enjoying this. Yes. Yes.
she did a great job, like a fantastic job. Like, okay, girl, like I don't even, um, I mean, like, of course I was hoping that she would have only done a great job because she was singing Whitney Houston. And like I said, not everybody should be singing Whitney Houston. So like, yes, I am very happy that she did a great job, uh, but she did more than a great job though, you know? And like, as the song went on and she was like, you know, like you saw, like, like she was like, I don't even know, like moving and bouncing, I guess. I don't know. And I liked her facial expressions a lot. And like everything about it was just like flawless. Like, like, okay. Like, <laughs> um, yeah, I don't even know. Um, yeah. But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and move on to the second video of part one. And I'm going to be reacting to three videos in each part, except for the last part. I believe it'll be two videos. Um, but yeah, so now I will be reacting to her cover Bridge Over Troubled Water. So let's get right into that. And she looks great for her age, too. Like, she's not old. I saw she was, I forgot, like, 41 or something like that. So she's, like, not old. But she looks great. Like, fabulous, completely. Okay, don't even. Her voice is very soft, like, I love that. When, you're down and out. well, now it's not so soft, but still. <laughs> Like, literally everybody, like, just has, like, their eyes closed or they're, like, feeling the music and stuff, like. I am too, though. <laughs> kind of. Yes, 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 yes.
Like, she's really feeling the emotions. The way she ended that and everything, yes, yeah, standing ovation. Oh my gosh, bruh! Like she was in it to win it. Like, good lord! Like, like oh my god, she was she was. Especially, I wasn't expecting her to end it the way she did. Eat her and cry like she, like this. Like she just ended it. She was like done. She was like. And like I feel like she um I feel like she was also like um like her attitude when she was singing the song was like, like she was like I got this, you know, and I feel like as the song went on and stuff especially towards the end of the song and she was like 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 the vibe I got from her or whatever was like I nailed this, you know. Like I feel like, like I feel like she like felt proud of herself and crap. She was like, oh my God, I got this. Like this, like yes. And that energy was so amazing. I love that energy. Like, oh my lord. Okay. So yeah, I love that performance. Like yes, yeah, so far out of the two videos I watched of her so far, that one's my favorite performance. Like that one. That one. I love that one. Okay. So now um, I will be watching one last video for part one. Um, and this time I'll be watching her uh, cover Lean On Me by Michael Bolton. So let's go. And also, homegirl got some really nice dresses. Is that who I thought it was? Is that who I thought it was in the audience? I don't quite recognize him, but like... And then they show Jay Park. How is she like, <laughs> she was like jamming out like she was at the club or something like that. That is him. That's Michael Bowen, ain't it? Wow, I wonder how she feels to be performing a Michael Bowen song in front of Michael Bowen. <laughs> yes. 
Yes, Allie. Everybody's reactions too, like, are amazing. I like this version too, like Silk Lines version. Yes, okay. Yes. Okay, guys, she is my best friend. Like literally. I just like as like as I was watching these videos, I'm like, this girl is like more and more like my best friend. And like I'm so happy now. I have met my best friend. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> And she's a whole power vocal, like, oh my god, um, yeah, that was a that was a great video. Um, I uh, yeah, <laughs> she did a great job performing. Like, is like you know, she was like born to be on the stage. You can tell that she was born to be on the stage, um, and stuff. And you can really tell that she's like into the songs that she's singing. Like she's really feeling it and everything. And that makes the performance even more enjoyable. Um, and like the whole thing was just great. And everybody who was reacting to her too, like their reactions were great. And the audience was into it too. You got to include the audience, you know, you got to engage them in your performance. Like, she just did like everything that like a perfect performance would be, you know, for me anyway, you know, a perfect performance for me is engaging with the audience and confetti. <laughs> I love confetti. Um, and of course, you know, strong vocals, like you, you have to sing, you, you know, that's really bad if you can't sing. I mean, it kind of kills the performance <laughs> a little bit. Um, and also you, like knowing and feeling the song and stuff and like knowing that you're doing a great job. And then also I really like when a performance has has live music and stuff um, and not just having the track being played in the background or something like it. A, a performance is so much more better with with like people playing the instruments and 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 you got an orchestra or whatever, you know, it is so much better. Um. But yeah, so she had like all of like my favorite elements to a perfect performance. So I am very satisfied right now. And I cannot wait to um, watch her other performances in these uh, in these parts coming up. Because like, go best friend. <laughs> like, yeah, she's just she's just a whole queen right now to me. Like, I'm just I'm just awestruck. So like, yeah. And, and like, I, and like the person who, who commented these videos to said how she was a cancer survivor and crap, like that's inspirational as crap. Like if I wanted to become a singer, like 
I think it's safe to say um, that So Fong would be one of my big, one of my inspirations for becoming a singer because she can actually sing and she has talent and she has had such a, um, a rough past and stuff. So like, yeah, like she, like, yeah, she would be one of my biggest inspirations if I was to become a singer, which I'm not, but she would be. Um, yeah. So yeah. Anyways, so I will end part one here. Um, if you guys enjoyed this, then please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in part two coming very soon. Later.